My name is Lisa Sue. I'm with Freescale Semiconductor, and I run the networking and multimedia group. In the networking and multimedia group, we make microprocessors for a range of applications, including uh, networking and communications, as well as application processors for consumer and automotive infotainment devices. So Computex is a great show uh, based here in Taiwan. It has um, basically everybody in, who matters in one place at one time. So it's uh, very, very good for us. You know, this year, it's the year of the tablet, of course, and um, a lot of um, very innovative devices, as well as you know, overall ecosystem um, is, is here in Taiwan. So we see Taiwan as really a key market for us, particularly to accelerate innovation and get um, some of the new concept products out for our uh, microprocessors in the uh, consumer space. You know, I think the key here is that there's a lot of choice. Um, it's not about one device. You know, everyone has um, is always looking for the killer app, and I think the key thing is there is no one killer app. Um, there are lots of different devices. I think everyone's looking to differentiate um, the uh, the devices from, let's call it, a typical you know iPad-like device. And we see some very low-cost uh, devices out there, as well as we see um, a lot of integration. Um, we see uh, similar platforms uh, in uh, tablets going into a lot of other spaces uh, as well in uh, more um, industrial and service provider spaces. So I think the key is that uh, there's tremendous potential and the market size of this market is you know, tremendously larger than, let's call it, the, the PC market. And so I think that's, that's pretty exciting. Um, there's a lot of you know, new devices that are uh, coming out with you know, new graphics functions, new video functions, new um, integration capability. Well, you know, for Freescale, our view is that embedded processing, let's call it, you know, things outside of the traditional uh, netbook, laptop, um, you know, sort of desktop market is really where all the growth is. And we define embedded processing pretty broadly. So that includes um, what I said, you know, consumer devices, as well as a whole range of industrial devices like smart metering and those types of applications. So. Uh, you know, Intel's a great company, and they have uh, you know a very um, you know very key place in the market. But you know we believe that the growth in the world is really coming from embedded processing, and there, there's just no one-stop shop. I mean, there's no one single device that's going to matter um, in this space. There's going to be lots and lots of devices, and they all need to be connected, and they all need to have you know good uh, features and functions, and that opens up the opportunity uh, for companies like ourselves to really innovate in this market.